Hello, I welcome for this developing associate dialectic series of uh, module 11. Uh, in this uh, module 11, uh, we have this uh, what is this uh, defining workflows to orchestrate functions. So, in this uh, module, let us go for uh, this uh, knowledge check. We have about 10 questions to answer and we need to score at least uh, 70 percent and please remember you can uh, attempt any unlimited times this particular exercise and also these questions are very very important for your exam preparation okay for this developer associate so now let us start this uh, module 11 knowledge check so here on your screen the first question so which scenario suggests the need for a task coordination service such as aws step functions so a serverless application must run a series of aws lambda functions that are dependent on each other this should be the right answer let us check okay the second question which statement describes a benefit of using aws step functions for an application so developers can use step functions to build visual workflows let me check yes this is correct the third question what is the role of the task state type in aws step functions so so task states uh, perform a unit of work so this should be the right one yes four an application that process orders return must complete different steps depending on whether the return is within 30 days of purchase which aws step functions state could a developer use to implement this logic this is choice okay the fifth one an application that process order returns process order returns must run the same aws lambda function for each item in an order which aws step function state could a developer use to implement this logic so here we can use this map okay a map state dynamically iterates on a uh, step for each item in an array okay the sixth one which statement is true for both succeed states and fail states so this is uh, So, succeed states and fail states do not include the next field. Okay. The seventh question. An application that process order returns must run two independent audit checks. When both checks are successfully completed, the return authorization step is run. Which AWS step function state could a developer use to implement the logic? It is parallel. Okay. The eighth question, how is a task token used in an AWS step functions use case that includes a manual approval step? Yeah, a task token uh, is returned as part of a call to the get activity task action and is used when calling the send task success action to associate a result within a task this should be the right one yes ninth question which use case is good fit for aws step functions express workflows so this is uh, the workflow must support a very high rate of events that come from iot devices internet of thing devices let me check i suppose yes the last question in this module 11 which statement about aws step functions is true so, a, a developer can use Amazon API Gateway to associate their step function APIs with methods in an API Gateway API. Let me check. Yes, this is the correct answer. So, in this module 11, congratulations, we have secured 100%. So, let us meet again in module 12. Thank you. 
and bye